What's up, everybody? It is me, King Alpha. Hope everybody is doing freaking great. So we got Twitch drops, winter holiday Twitch drops again. And the amazing thing is there's two Twitch drops this time. I'm going to be sharing you guys all the rewards and everything, the time and you know, the time required to actually get all of the rewards and stuff that you have to watch and everything. And obviously when it's going to happen. So first thing is you can obviously see there is a new mount already. I don't have any of the stats on the mount or anything. They'll probably be releasing it. And then I'll probably put a comment down below, you know, saying what the stats of the, the, the new horse is going to be. It's probably going to be another purple horse, um, kind of like how it was for the Halloween Twitch drops. But this time it's obviously a white horse. And I think everybody's going to probably go crazy for this white horse and everything. So, you know. Definitely stay tuned in for that. So the first um, the first Twitch shop event is actually on December 22nd to the 28th. And then it says, um, and then New Year's 2021 campaign will be December 31st to January 1st. Don't worry, the rewards for those aren't the best, but it's still really great. Um, so also it says that the campaigns will start 12 UTC, 13 CET, and then 4 PST. So depending on whatever time that is for you guys, you know, obviously do the calculations, you know, google like i did 12 etc to uk just making sure you know i wanted to make sure the times i got it all right um so some of the great rewards that we're going to be getting this season so this is obviously going to be for the first twitch shop so the actual like winter holidays campaign it's going to be the well-made thunderstar you have to obviously um you know it's not dependent however the next drops are dependent so if you guys didn't know before when you were actually requiring to like basically interact with the stream because when you watched if you hit your requirement for the spy master's report for one hour and you didn't claim it you won't continue to actually continue to claim the rest of the drops so this is something big for you guys you guys need to make sure that you actually claim the drop one by one by one by one so it makes it a little bit more interactive with the stream and everything you know obviously you have to pay attention because this entire thing takes up uh i think you have to have a watch time of 12 hours now keep in mind guys this doesn't mean yet you have to watch 12 hours one entire day but this also means that you can watch you know within 12 hours uh between the 22nd to the 28th so for example Let's say you get to the rare armor schematic selection, you get to, you know, you get up to there and then you have to go and you have to like, uh, you're, you have to go work or you have to go and do a family thing for Christmas or whatever. Um, you know, then you go back and you put on the stream, you know, the 25th or the 26th and you're like, okay, boom, I get my seven day premium count treaty phantom and all that stuff. So, you know, just keep in mind guys, you don't have to get all your rewards immediately. The first day, it's probably the easiest because especially with the, you know, event starting on the 22nd, um, you know, it's right, it's before Christmas and everything. You won't have to worry about it for the rest of the Christmas and all that stuff. So yeah. Um, and definitely as well, guys, I'm going to be streaming on the 22nd, 23rd. I will be trying to stream on the 24th and 25th. We'll see. Um, but then I know after that 26th, 27th, 28th, I won't be streaming. And if you guys did not know, January 1st is my birthday as well. Um, so as you guys can see, it's a phantom horse. Um, so I didn't even go over the rewards. I'm sorry. I was talking about the method of how it's done. So we got the well-made Thunderstar, the Spy Master's Report. The, which is basically the glory for the battle pass um the rare armor schematic uh the seven day premium account treaty the phantom horse and the heroic era synaculum chest which is amazing so i think obviously the best stuff in here is obviously the the glory the the armor schematic the premium account treaties is good stock up on treaties for the you know the purple schematic i mean the purple doctrines uh the phantom horse is the best thing here and then obviously the uh hero synaculum so it's telling you here note that the players can choose from one of the following so any of these synaculums and everything so any you know unit that you need to actually get that you don't have um honestly i have all of these so i'm not sure whether maybe i just use it on like a unit that i want to you know level up without having to actually use it which I think it's almost all of these but um anyway so now we're gonna go over to new year's 2021 campaign so if you guys didn't know like i said january 1st is my birthday so i will probably do a little birthday stream um still trying to figure out my birthday plans and stuff so anyways we got three sparky rockets then we got a well-made thunderstar three sparky rockets well-made thunderstar three sparky rockets well-made thunderstar and then a party animal title which is awesome i think i want to get the, the party animal title just because of the fact that you know it's my birthday new year's 
you need the damn thing. So, like I said before, it's all dependent on the player and everything. I told you guys how to get your drops, how to claim them and everything. I even made videos before of how to claim your drops. Um, but, so the Winter Holidays campaign, like I said, you need a total of 12 hours and 15 minutes in total to, like, have been able to complete all the rewards and all the time and then for the new year's one it's literally only three hours and 30 minutes so like i said the new year's rewards aren't the best but you know well made thunder star it's nice to have like even like little um you know cannons and stuff that are from like new years or whatever and save them so you know people that join the game they're like oh my god which is that all stuff um but i'm just gonna click this over here and i'm gonna be showing you guys uh, basically just the mount a little bit closer. I'll probably be able to get a better, you know, image when they actually send out one and when they actually, uh, give out the course details and everything. So I'll put that below, um, in the comment section, but I just wanted to give you guys, you know, a major heads up of, you know, a new horse coming into CB again, um, for Twitch drops. And hopefully everybody's really excited for the Twitch drops and everything that is going to be coming on the 22nd to the 28th. And then the 31st of January 1st. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope I did not talk too fast and I hope this was just, you know, entertaining for you guys and hopefully very informative. I'll be seeing you guys deuces.